Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Bloodborne. My name is Razorbrand. I just can't put the controller down because, as you saw last episode, we made progress. We've made progress. I am incredibly proud of us making progress. So, we went to Old Yarnum, back to Old Yarnum, down memory lane in the last episode, and we took care of some things. And it was beautiful. Oh, geez. Blood gem fortification. I need more blood gems. Oh, I see. Okay, that's fine. I thought I could repair more, but nope, that's not the case. That's totally fine by me. Do you have anything new? Um... What? This looks... All right, I'm gonna get the gown, and I'm gonna get the wolf cap, and I'm gonna get the the trousers. Yes. Oh my gosh, that's great. Um, let me check out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but like you know, my stats are boosted, and that's what matters. Um. Yes. <gasps> oh, uh, I like this outfit. Yep, yeah, this is my new outfit now. All right. This is my new outfit now. Okay, so. <clears throat> and with the blood veils that I have right now, I'm just going to buy the rest of that. Okay, awesome. So, we made some strides in the last episode that if we take a look take a launder we have all of these to buy 40,000 blood echoes this weapon must be worth getting if it is extremely expensive and there is new gear that is available for purchase as well which I'm also very excited about <laughs> So, here's what we're going to be doing in this episode. We're going to be continuing what we did in the last episode and explore all of these different places that we've been to before and see what happens if we defeat these bosses and all of that stuff. Because I have my Hunter Axe back. That bitch is back, baby. And it's been great. It's been absolutely great. And I fortified it to be even stronger. I just want to check something real, real, real quick. <clears throat> Because if we go, because I talked about this in the last episode, if we go into, or previous episodes as well, before I mentioned it in this episode, if we go to the Cathedral Ward, there's that door on the right. The door on the right there, are we able to access what's in that door? Because that's another whole optional area that we can go and we can explore, but you had to do some things at Old Yarnum first before you can even attempt to go over there. So I'm wondering, now that I've defeated these hunters in Old Yarnum, can I make myself go to this section on the right? Is this going to be like a whole new area for me to explore where I can train and all of that such? The door is right here. Door is still closed. It's still closed. But you're still sitting here. You. Stay away from me. Old hag, how dare you talk to me like that? Old hag. All right. All right, so there obviously is that way with Vicar Amelia. I really want that door to be unlocked, but unfortunately, that's not the case. That's not the case. So it seems like this episode... I'm gonna travel my way back to Crazy Witch Town Central, where all the crazy ladies that are laughing hysterically. We're gonna go back there. The lovely witch that we fought in that episode. We're gonna take a crack at her again. 
Because I was extremely close to defeating her. She was close to dying. She was extremely close to dying. Extremely close to dying. And... I think I can beat her. So we're gonna fight her. Beat her. See if we get anything out of it. A. And then we can just, we can move on from there. And then if it gets to the point where we can go and we can fight Bakar, Amelia, if they really think that we're really ready for her, then so be it. Ugh. You ladies dry make me annoyed so much. See, this is why I don't, I don't like being here because you're just rude like that. You're just rude. Like, insanely rude. I don't appreciate you. Alright, I'm just gonna walk past Jen. And call. Stay away from me. Alright. <clears throat> now, if I remember correctly... Okay. Now, if I remember correctly... Yes, that does take me up to the troll, but what if I didn't want to go that way? What if I wanted to go back? Aha! You were surprised. Bye! You're dead. Scaredy lady. Oh, that's right. Yep, and you're gonna throw- you're gonna kill nature again. Once again. I know. I honestly think with what this witch has to offer, I can easily kill her with the amount of blood uh, veils that I have on me. Don't come near me, please. I know what you're capable of. You're not a fan of mine. I'm just gonna move on. Alright. Let's just see what happens. All right, where's yours? There you are. All right, where's your walking friend? Where's your walking buddy? You have a walking buddy. Alright, I'm gonna just try. Oh, anyway. <clears throat> I'm doing like more significant damage. This is beautiful. You are almost dead. Alright, where you at? Anyway. Oh, that's right. I have to kill the other one. There's two of you.
please don't. That's rude. Where you at? There you are. Alright. This seems to be going way better than last time. Where you at, lady? I'm surprised that... I'm like really surprised that your henchmen are not even walking around. It's just... No, 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 no. I'm just really surprised that your henchmen are not even, like, moving around, you know what I mean? Okay. Is. Can you stop it? I hate when you do that. In like you know episode seven or chapter seven but i just got dicked because my health wasn't as high as it needed to be lovely all right well that's always pleasant all right well there we go we defeated the witch she's dead great that's fantastic all right i have fourteen thousand blood echoes i'm going to return back to the hunter's dream i'm going to probably level myself up that's the smart thing to do i'm gonna probably level well i mean i i mean i could get new gear i could get new gear too well, all right let me see what i can do let me let me see what i can do whoa 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 well good hunter i totally didn't find okay i get it 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 hold on totally forgot to totally like you know you know spewed my mind you know that i had that and i need that doink there we go that's 1200 and i have two insight which means i have enough to get the um 
the gloves. If I want to, like, fully deck out, you know what I mean? Hee 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 hee. Alright, so let me just put on the ashen gloves. Doink. Alright, there we go. Ooh. Nice. Alright, so now that we have 16... Welcome, Udi. 16,000. I would love to heal myself up just a little bit more. Boost myself in endurance. And then I'd say more in strength. Because I think... My health is good. My health is really good. So, I'm gonna level up two more times. That puts me at 37. That's pretty good. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna probably... Yes, thank you. I'm gonna just, if I get more blood echoes and all that good stuff, I'm just going to use said blood echoes for, um, I'm just gonna save those blood echoes for all of the new gear that I could get, and, like, the new weapons, if I wanna try, like, the new weapons. Like, that Blade of Mercy that's, like, 40,000 doesn't hurt, you know, to, to, like, you know, try to get it i mean i bet it's like a really really good weapon you just have to fortify it so much in order to proficiently use it you know the way you want it to be all right so we're in here i'm gonna see what happens if i were to go downward if i were to continue down this spiral let's see what happens infected one waits ahead good Oh, this is pleasant. Oh. Okay. It is all thanks to Hunter. May the good blood guide your way. Oh. Oh. That's it. That's it. All right. So be it. All right. Ugh. It's like I fought that witch, right? And I should feel accomplished in some way, you know, about all of this. And I just, for some reason, I just, I don't. I don't know. Okay, well, you know what I can do? I know this wasn't on my objective for this episode specifically, but I can always go and give Vicar Amelia another go. I would love to, but the time being, I only have seven blood veils. You know what I can do? There is that annoying hunter in the Tomb of Odin. I want to show him a thing or two. <gasps> Not functioning at this time? Probably because of the, um... The hunter that's there. If I, yeah. If I had to guess. I'm gonna see what happens if I'm able to defeat this hunter. Show him who's boss. Go from there. See what happens there. And then if there's enough time at the end of this episode, I will give another go at a good old Vicar Amelia. See if I'm ready to go at her. And then we go from there. We go from there. Because pretty much like in my own spare time, I've gone around and I've explored through all of these like different places that I've been to before. Like Old Yarnum, like Hemlock. Like all these different places, gathered all the items that I needed and all that stuff to level up and all that good stuff. Um, but like, you know, obviously like these hunters, I haven't even like tried against. So. Sheesh. All right, so I'm gonna fight these trolls because these trolls are good boys and they give me good blood echoes. There we 
the gun. Alright. Just to give me some more blood veils for when I take on this hunter that's in the tomb of Odin. Because God forbid. Yeah, I'm really happy with this outfit. I earned this outfit. I earned it, earned it, earned it. So, so good. I earned it, earned it, earned it. Let's go down the elevator. Let's go say hi to our lovely friends on the bridge. Get the fireball going. No, mm -hmm. I feel so good right now. All right. All right, you boys. I did also raise my strength, so that's probably another good thing, too. Come on, you boys. You're so lucky. Good. You're still alive. I'm so proud. Alright. Let us fight this troll really quick. Oh, you still have blood echoes of mine. From when I died. There we go. All right. 12 blood echoes. That should be good. Let's just see if um, this works in our favor. Because there is the hunter that's just sitting over there looking pretty. Don't know why, but we're going to show him who's boss. Don't show him who's boss. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Uh, maybe I don't show him who's boss. Yeah, I think that's fair. Fair. Yeah. Fair. 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 Okay, that's fine. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I. Yeah. All right. Well. That's not going to get me anywhere. <laughs> Just, no. We're going to go fight the car, Amelia. We're going to go... We're just going to do what I said I was not going to do in this episode. We're just going to do it, and we're just going to see if it actually pays off. We're just going to see. We're just going to see. We're just going to see. Everything's going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. No, 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 no. So, you know, we'll just, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Everything will be good. We'll make it work. <laughs> I just want you to progress in the way. Yeah, my lady friend's still dead, so I don't know how you feel about that. Okay. <clears throat> Alright. Let's give this old buddy a try. Now that is beautiful once again. I can fight you once again. That is beautiful. Get... Oh, yes. This is all beautiful. No, don't trust you. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. The fact that my axe is beautiful again, it just it makes me so incredibly happy. All right. No. 
Dude, how many times have I told you to not do that? Alright, I'm just gonna run past. I don't need to be here. Ugh, intruder. Intruder. Intruder walking through the pram ass. Oh, I know, mister. I know. I know. Alright. Vicar Amelia. We'll see if this works. We'll see if I'm prepared for Vicar Amelia. And to get things going, I'm gonna have on me bolt paper just to see if it works. Let's try it. Hello, beautiful. It's nice to see you. Nice to see you.
okay, 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 okay. Not on my agenda for today, but it, it is there. Oh, I'm shaking. Oh, that was it. That bowl paper did me so nicely. Light this fucking lamp, please. Thank you. Oh my gosh. What is this? Let's inspect this. Oh my god. Master Willem, I've come to bid you farewell. Oh, I know, I know. You think now to betray me. No, but you will never listen. I tell you, I will not forget our adage. We are born of the blood. Made men by the blood. Undone by the blood. Our eyes are yet to open. Fear the old blood. I must take my leave. Interesting. Huh. Interesting. Okay. <sighs> so, what the fuck does this mean now? I was not expecting to defeat Vicar Amelia in this episode, but it happened, and it did, and once again, I just stayed silent <sighs> oh my gosh I think me fortifying that axe repairing this axe and just full out doing all of that yes alright I don't know where the hell I'm supposed to go from here but I will say this I am incredibly happy right now. I am so happy right now. I'm going to go back. <sighs> like, I'm like, <laughs> like, I am like still a little bit shaken from this. Crazy. I think I'm at a good enough level right now. I think I'm at a really good enough level. I'm going to do this. I'm going to buy some armor. I'm going to really buy some armor here. <clears throat> so I've got 15,000. So I'm going to... All right, let's compare the difference between the beak mask and the um, gray wolf. Okay, so 50, 40, 40, 50, 20, 50, 30. 50, 40, 40, 50, 20, 50, 30. I can remember that. 50, 40, 40, 50, 20, 50, 30. 50, 40, 40, 50, 20, 50, 30. Oh, that's better. This mask is better. All right, I'm gonna get the beak mask just to start things off. Ooh, and I can get a new weapon. Ooh, the rifle spear? I don't know. I'm not, I'm a little skeptical about that. That's, uh, I don't know. Um, I'm then I'm gonna use the rest of the blood echoes. Could get the repeating pistol, but I don't know. I think for my sake, I'm just gonna get more cocktails because that sliced me really, really well. Just so that I have used the blood echoes for like good logical sense. And I know I could fortify but i don't have i don't think enough bloodstone shards to even do that so that's fine i'm gonna switch masks as much as i love wearing this gray wolf cap i'm gonna wear ah oh, jeez. 
<laughs> I look fun. I look fun, don't I? Oh, I look like fun. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I look like fun. I look a lot like fun. All right. So that's the Grand Cathedral. Where are we supposed to go from here? I don't know. Let me... All right. Let's do this. Let's do this. I'm going to go back to the Grand Cathedral. Yeah. I'm going to go back to the Grand Cathedral. And we're just going to back... Okay. My cords are freaking out. We're just going to backtrack with everything. And we're just going to figure out where we're supposed to go. We're just going to backtrack everything and we're just going to experiment. We're just going to see what we need to do, where we need to go, so on and so forth. If we need to go into the area of the crazy ladies, then by all means, that's fine. And I think I've now been advanced enough that I don't need the Kirk hammer anymore. I'm going to go back to my saw spear. For training. I'm going to go back to my saw spear for training purposes. So. Unless I am mistaken. And there is something actually within the Grand Cathedral. That I can. Open. Close. So on and so forth. I don't see anything. I was just not expecting. To defeat Vicara Amelia. In one go. After all this time. But here we are. Here we are aren't we. It's crazy. I just, I'm still shocked. I'm still shocked about that. Holy fuck. All right. Where's the Pope? Ah. Here, right here. Ow. So you're telling me that I can defeat Vicar Amelia like that, but yeah, I can't defeat two, P two Pope, two Popes from the church. This is a really sad day. This is a really, really sad day. If you ask me, this is an extremely, extremely sad day. If I'm going to be real honest here, this is extremely a sad day indeed. A sad day, indeed. All right. So if we were to go left here, this takes us to Hemlock, right? Yes, it takes us to Hemlock. I don't need to go that way because I already have lanterns within that area. I don't need that. I don't need that. I'm trying to remember what was on the right side if I went right. I'm going to explore a little bit down further this path. What was down this way? Is that actually where I need to go? Let's have a look-see. Let's just have a look-see. Is this actually where I need to go? Let's just take a look. That's right. There was a hunter here, and this is where I got my bolt paper. And that's right, there's another one right there. Hmm, okay. I'm trying to think here. Are you worth fighting? Excuse me. You are starting to piss me off. Stop shooting. 
for the once in your life. Stop it. Okay, honey. So that's how it's gonna be, honey bee. That's how it's gonna be, huh? That's how it's gonna be. Bitch. <sighs> Fine. 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 You wanna play it that way? Fine. I just won't fight you, because you're rude as fuck. Fine. Fine. I have... No remorse in avoiding you. Fine. Whatever. Fine. I just want to progress and see what is even down here, and I can't do that when you're shooting me up the storm. You're Miss Shooty Shooter. That's who you are. Miss Shooty McShooterson. And I don't appreciate it. Yes, because yes, I defeated this hunter right here. You gone. Goodbye. And you're just rude. So you know what? I'm not dealing with anything that you have to offer right now. Just, no. Okay, Fear Executioner. Okay. Oh, that's right. Oh, that's right. This is a chamber. That's right. And then when I tried to mess with the spirits and all, things just got mad at me and I got, shh, you know. Nope. I remember now. I tried to open the gate and it got mad. So... Um, I don't know. I don't know what to do, to be quite honest with you. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure with where I'm supposed to go next. So this is what's going to happen. I'm going to end this episode right here. If I feel like it on the side, I'll just, I'll fight that shooty mcshooterson on my own then again you'll probably want to see me fight her because bleh, he's just annoying as fuck i don't know where to go exactly so i'm gonna do some digging and figure out where i'm supposed to be going and then that will be the segue for the next episode because the car amelia is now dead thank the heavens she's gone so now we can progress and move on word it's exciting stuff. So, with all of this in mind, 
thank you so much for watching this episode of Bloodborne. Please feel free to leave a like if you liked what you saw. Feel free to ring those bells and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. We did some good things here. We defeated the Witch of Hemlock and Vicar Amelia. Two in one. Kill two birds with one stone. Fantastic. Again, we're making strides. I can't wait to see where we go next. But as for right now, this has been Raisin Brand. Thank you so much once again for watching this episode of Bloodborne, and I shall see you in the next video.